it's the end of day five we just got done sawing much more trees it rained again last night we got one more day before it rains again again and we're supposed to get like an inch of rain on saturday so sunday is supposed to get down to freezing temps so it's gonna be it's rough it has been rough this whole project just muddy sticky wet hard to get fires going but we actually got three of them going right now you can see behind me dad's got one back there with the blower he's trying to milk but uh trevor's feeding this one over here with the excavator and uh trying to get some of this stuff burned just to clean up everything where the pond's gonna go just so many trees it's unreal how how many trees you got to get rid of when you're trying to clear for a pond at least the size of the pond we're clearing here it's going to be about three or four acres by the time we're done and just uh what we've done so far i can tell you it's probably going to take another week with excavators so we'll probably have to rent it again because we're, we're still not done and we're just getting rained out there's gonna be at least two days of being rained out this week and we were hoping to utilize every single day but it just ain't gonna happen so probably gonna have to wait until it dries up get a dozer out here just so we can kind of clean up everything once we're done so do a little bit more filming tomorrow and uh probably wrap this project up for now until we can at least get some of the lumber out of here sell it off to the lumber yard see what we can get out of that maybe make our money back hopefully I don't know, we'll see what the, uh, the guys at the lumber yard say, so we'll let you know. supposed to rain about a half inch tomorrow on Saturday Sunday it's gonna be down to freezing temps so we got to get it wrapped up Trevor's just over here cleaning up some logs sell for the lumber yard got a guy coming by today to look at it see what we got in timber here hopefully we'll get it two three grand back and uh, get this stuff loaded up while we still have the excavator so Still burning. We'll be burning this stuff into the springtime. Got three fires going. So it'll be, it'll be a hot minute before we get all this stuff burned up. It's just been so wet. It rained again last night. It'll rain again tomorrow. But today's just more or less a cleanup day. And Sucker's gonna fall right on them. 
going. He's shaking. Yeah. That son of a bitch is dying. It's going that way. He probably ought to get back, Quaze. Yeah. Yeah, I, I see it getting ready to go. I'll get back here by the excavator. Going, it's going, Trev. It's going. Watch out! Watch out! I want to kick it back at you. That's why you leave it on this side so it'll pull away from it. That's pretty good, but we need to get another operator and let you saw. Job's over and now I got the dozer fixed. Uh, it kills me. I think we're just gonna do one pond over here because this backside ain't gonna be worth it to try to come and cut all out of it out. They don't connect together, so I think we're just gonna do this one big pond and leave the rest in the woods. So it's gonna be a pretty decent sized pond though. We got a couple acre pond over here and hopefully this spring we can come out, get some more equipment out here and get in here and get to work get this pond done but uh it's been a hell of a project so far six days of grinding turn around and show you fires seem to never burn all the way through starts smoking a lot got here this morning and uh got some hot coals and stuff but pretty much went out after the rain and had to get them going again. It's just a full-time job, just stoking fires with the excavator. Try to get all this stuff burned up. Well, thanks for watching. Try to get the drone out here and get this uh, Kind of show you what an overview of this project. 
six days of fun in the mud. But it's what you gotta do when you wanna get a pond together, especially one this size. So don't always work out the way you want when you buy a property. I already have a pond there, so sometimes you gotta clear a bunch of woods and make your own if you got the area to do it in. We just happen to have a, a nice creek bed running through here. And uh, all we gotta do now is just get a tractor and pan out here and a dozer and probably the excavator to finish this up, but we'll get it done. It's gonna be a nice size pond and uh, it's gonna separate kind of in between where we're gonna be building. So take a jet ski over to my house if he wants to. Stay tuned when we actually get back in here and do some work. Thanks for watching. Appreciate your support. Hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already. Stay tuned for the next one.